animals of the same kind but different in some ways or characteristics. Tortoises and Turtles Tortoises and turtles look very much alike. Most tortoises live on land. Most turtles live in water. Both of them have a pair of toothless jaws with sharp edges for cutting up food. Tortoises eat plants only, while some turtles eat plants and others eat mostly meat. Both of them have a hard shell for shelter and protection. Other animals like snails and clams are also covered with shells. Can you name other animals with bodies that are covered with shells? Please comment down below. Chickens and Pigeons Chickens and pigeons belong to the group of animals called birds. They both have beaks and claws which they use to get food. Both of them have a pair of wings. Pigeons can fly from one place to another. Chickens have wings too, but they cannot fly high. Sometimes they flap their wings to fly over a short distance. Chickens cannot stay in the air for a long time. Pigeons and chickens are covered with feathers. Can you name other animals with feathers? Please comment down below. Crocodiles and Alligators Crocodiles and alligators are large animals with bodies covered with dry and bumpy scales. They have long powerful tails which they use in swimming and defending themselves. Their eyes, ears, and nostrils are found on top of their long head, which they show slightly above the water when they float on the surface. Alligators have a shorter and wider head that is more U-shaped, while crocodiles have a longer V-shaped head. The fangs of crocodiles stick out on each side of the lower jaw when their mouth is closed. Other animals that are covered with scales are lizards and snakes. Butterflies and Moths Butterflies and moths are both insects. They are so much alike that it is sometimes hard to know one from the other. Both have two wings. They also have antennae, which they use for touching and smelling. They both hatch from caterpillars, which look like worms. Butterflies and moths have differences too. Butterflies have long, slender, and hairless bodies, while moths have thick, and furry bodies. Butterflies fly only during the day and when resting, they fold their wings straight up. Moths usually fly at night and when resting, they spread their wings flat. Different animals that are similar in some ways. Fish and Whales Whales look a lot like fish. Both have tails and fins, but there are some differences between these two animals. Whales have smooth, firm skin. Fish have scales. Whales have tails called flukes that they move up and down when they swim. Fish have tails that they swing from side to side. Whales breathe with lungs and must hold their breath while underwater. They come to the water surface to breathe in fresh air. Fish, on the other hand, breathe underwater by using their gills. Bats and birds Before, people used to think bats were birds without feathers. We now know that there is no such thing as a featherless bird. Bats are mammals and birds are part of the bird family. Bats have fur on their bodies like cats and dogs. Birds have feathers covering their bodies. Bats are born alive from their mother's body. A bird hatches from eggs. Baby bats are called pups. Pups drink milk from their mothers. A baby bird eats worm and bugs that the mother brings. 
Birds have wings. Bots have wings with arms that look like long fingers. Spiders and insects. Both spiders and insects are invertebrates, but there are several distinct characteristics that separate spiders from insects. If you will look closely at a spider and an insect, you can see how different they are. An insect has three main body parts. The head is in front. The thorax is the next part. The abdomen is behind the thorax. Most insects have wings. Insects also have six legs attached to their chest. A spider has two main body parts. The head and chest make one part. The abdomen is behind. A spider has eight legs and no wings.